Hello my friends and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Well, finally an article about uh, that fantastic country called uh, Romania. And uh, I think it's a neutral article, but it's interesting um, because Romania wants to buy drones all of a sudden. They can't produce drones because Romania are retards or something. I don't understand this. Uh, Poland went to South Korea to buy over there some planes like Poland doesn't have to build their own planes is it cheaper to buy from a different country hundreds of millions of dollars of planes when you can build your own research center and your aeronautical uh, capabilities I don't understand this and you will and then you will sell airplanes but you you can't catch up you can't you know like they do you know steal from left and right and get something that will be performant I don't understand this now Romania and Romanians are not idiots they buy from Turkey drones what I'm not saying the Turks are bad or something but not they're not geniuses and they build drones and their smart Romanians are incapable to building drones I think they can are incapable of being building toy drones civilian drones that's I don't know it's an insult but whatever maybe that's the reality we're just and we don't know it this article comes from Reuters from September 1st, 2022. Romania to buy drones from Turkey. By car, the Turkey is by car as part of military endowment. From whom? Who's going to pay for that? International banking system and you pay with interest? Romania play, uh, plans to buy three... <laughs> I don't read the article before I make videos. Sometimes I just go over a few like bam, 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 to see if uh, you know they provide data or so I didn't read this article so it's a surprise for me right now to read how many drones Romania will buy from Turkey three three T H R E E means three in English oh my god Romania plans to buy three unmanned aerial vehicles Systems from Turkey defense firm Baikar, along with logistics support for an estimated 300 million before tax, the defense ministry said on t Thursday. Maybe they buy the those just to you know do reverse engineering or whatever and see how it was built. And maybe they're gonna buy, build better ones. Then this is the only the only justification that I would give to Romanians. Uh, for this purchase if there's a purchase of three <laughs> my God. all right the ministry said it requested approval from the Romanian Parliament to begin the tender process to acquire 18 by car by Kashtar TB2 drones designated for its ground forces so it's 18 it was it's three unmanned aerial so what is that that's the number of that is not 18 pieces is it because over there it says three unmanned aerial vehicles and it says 18 TB2 drones destined for its ground forces as part of the country's NATO targets and its military endowment plans. This acquisition for which approval has been requested will be initiated from 2022 depending on funding possibilities, the ministry said in a statement. Romania, NATO, NATO member since 2004, plans to raise defense spending to 2.5 percent of gross domestic product next year that means funding the americans uh, weapon manufacturing jobs over here and all that that's great i got it so I said, ah, from two percent at present president klaus johannes said in march in response to russia's invasions of ukraine that's going to defend you a lot the country with with shares a 650 kilometer 400 mile border with Ukraine is host to US ballistic missiles 
that only US can touch. Romanians are just looking from outside the gate. Papara, oh, yeah, okay. That means we are allied. That this is the alliance, how it works, the alliance. They have over there the ballistic missiles defense system and the Romanians are just watching. That's operated 100% by Americans. But we are partners. That's how the partnership works. Vassal states, they use Romanian territory to defend Romania and they made Romania a target for nuclear attack from Russia. That's what Putin said when, yeah, you want those ballistic missiles over there, defense missiles that could be turned into offense in a second, it's just a switch? He said, no problem. Then you became a target for our nuclear arsenal, which you weren't until now. Good job, Romania. Well, that's fine. What don't you do for your boss? Everything, right? <sighs> As, all right. So earlier this year, Romania government, Romanian government, Romania's government approved a bill to buy 32 second-hand F-16 fighter jets from Norway. I don't know how you guys feel about, let's say it's a country that you still have, you know, affection for. Uh, I was born over there. I, you know, I live some years over there. I still have family over there. You know, I love the country. I don't really love the people, but, uh, and this is what they buy. 16 used F-16 made in what? In uh, 83, the first batch whenever the F-16 first came. If it's used, why would you buy it? It's an airplane. Can you buy five new ones instead of 16 used ones? It's okay. Poland buys new, new ones. We buy a second hand. You know, that's, this was the reason why I left that country too. Slaves, servant, attitude of servants. Remember slave mentality and master mentality by Nietzsche? It's called moral, uh, uh, you know, uh, slave morality and master morality or mentality, you can switch it. That is slave morality mentality. I left that country, I couldn't stand this kind of thing. I couldn't stand it. And they are the same. That's why I will not go back over there until I'm grabbed by my ankles and dragged out of this country. By myself, no. To, to see this every day, every day, I will just get in fist fights every five minutes over there and get crazy in about five days just watching TV, if I watch, which I don't. But look, I'm reading one article in three months about Romania and look, they're the same, the same weasels. Not weasels, weasels are sneaky, or no, uh, but these are just... I said enough. French firm Naval Group and Romanian company Sentinel Naval Constanza have yet to finalize a deal to sell going Navy Corvettes, I hope those are news, uh, Corvettes to Romania as well as re renewable to existing frag frigates, frigates, whatever you pronounce that, for a total of 1.2 billion. So those existing, they were just re refurbished. Great, fantastic. The country's biggest procurement contract to date has been a multi-year 4 billion euro US Riaton Patriot surface to air missile system with the first shipment delivered in 2020. Oh my God, great. It was one. <laughs> the T TB2 armed drones have been hugely popular in Ukraine where they help destroy Russian artillery systems and armored vehicles. The TB2, which has also been used in the conflict in Syria, Iraq, Libya, and Nagorno-Karabakh, now spearheads Turkey's global defense export push. So it seems like they buy 18 of this because here it says, this is how it starts. Russia plans to buy three unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, from Turkish defense. Okay, maybe that's, uh, all right, whatever that is. And then they say they will uh, acquire 18 Baikraktar TB2 drones. All right, well, maybe it's not the three, the three. I don't know. Anyway, they will buy used F-16s from Norway. Good job. Do they have engines? <laughs> Oh man. So this is Romania. This is Romania. And they are part of the system of buying military equipment from other countries from the same guy. 
but second hand sometimes right all right well get used to that because Romania will can withstand a war uh, against uh, Russia if they want believe me not thank you very much for being with me again today stay strong stay smart look for the truth and be just